Hey, surprise! The Andori Design Dreamers here. Yes, in the middle of the week. Yes, D. Dory. Yeah, we have a question for all of our viewers. Yes. We we are trying to think of something of our challenge box to put in there, and Dory's husband came up with a great idea, which we'll explain. Okay, so we would like to know your opinion about this and whether we should do this or not. Yeah, it's a suggestion my husband had. Yeah, and he's pretty. Brilliant guy, her husband is. That's why he married me. Mine's not bad either. <laughs> so anyway, um, it's about um, like creating our own fabric out of fabric that we already have or scraps of fabric. Scraps of fabric. Different, or it could be different lengths of fabric yeah. that we have and just kind of cut them up. And kind of like a patchwork. Yeah, kind of like a patchwork. And we would make that whatever length we would need it to be to cut out a garment. Mm -hmm. to sew mm -hmm. and then after we sew it or either before that was a thought she doris dory was thinking about after we make the garment to dye it yeah and i was thinking to dye it before i make the garment but anyway know, which would be better to but me, to me it would be make sense to do it afterwards yeah and i'm thinking i would do it before i would cut the garment out but after you've sewn the fabric pieces together. together to make the one like the yardage that I would need for that okay. garment. Okay. Is what I was thinking you want to do each individual piece. No, one. no, no, no. <laughs> that would be a waste but, of dye. But but the, the the dye part is what will tie it to get so like even though you have different colors and different yeah different designs, the dye part would make it cohesive because it's all in the same color lack of the dye. Is yeah, that right? that I guess. Right? And then you'd have to set the dye, which Dory's husband says uh, sodium carbonate is what you purchase uh, to set the dye in the fabric and it makes it dye brighter also. Right. So I don't and it know. Keeps we've it from got to other, yeah. into your other fabrics or your, yeah. your other laundry. He actually has it in a, in a pool and a spawn pool spawn thing. Pools bag. But he said you can buy it also as a dye. You can buy it. For a laundry brightener or something? Yeah. Is that what I he guess, said? I guess so. Something like that. We that's have to kind of look that up. Like that. Before that's... we do that, we'll, we'll yeah. figure that out. So that's an, uh, uh, just a suggestion that he had of putting it in the box. We just kind of know, want to know what you guys think. Should we do it? Or should we not? I've never dyed anything. I have in the past, a long time mm -hmm. ago. And I don't know if do you, you have still to have heat to... up the water. Yeah, or... I think it was a big boiling pot. And we used, you know, like, like a canning... You know, the big blue canning water I, bath. I have to come over and use your can. <laughs> well, if we were going to dye it the same color. Oh, no. We, we could do that. We we, okay, so then the other question would be, should we dye it the same color? Yes, or use different colors. Or should I use one color and she use another color? So that's another. Yeah, one. yeah. So, and yeah. Uh, yeah, we could even go as far as should we use the same pattern. <gasps> Ooh. Not fabric, but the same pattern. That's a thought. Lots of Different variations. variations there of what yeah. we could do. So, yeah, we'd like your opinion. Yeah. So, be sure and comment and let us know what your thoughts are on that. Yes. We really appreciate it. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Have a good day.